very excited about bringing stem cell therapy and treatment for uh, patients' aesthetic and um, sports injuries, but it can also be used for other problems, uh, inflammatory problems, chronic degenerative conditions. But uh, once we take the fat, then we bring it into a sterile clean room. Um, this room is dedicated to fat processing and processing of stem cells. And uh, we've taken the sterile container where we had harvested the fat. We're allowing gravity to allow the fat to rise to the surface. We're gonna decant that off. I need about 60 cc's of fat that we're gonna then uh, pull that fat off and then we're gonna save the rest of the fat and to use it as a volumizer, hamburger helper. I don't like that word, but I think everybody understands what I'm talking about when I use that. To volumize then whatever area, enriching it with the uh, stem cells that we're gonna process in this technique and through these counters, which will give us a viability count. Once the, the fat is um, removed, the, we separate it out, and then uh, once it's in the tray, we use an ultrasonic process. So this is more of a mechanical agitation, releasing the stem cells from the fat. We take the uh, separated fat and stem cells, um, process it and centrifuge it. Now the centrifuge is over here. We have to put these in equal amounts on either side, uh, spin it at 3,000 RPMs for just one minute. The pellet is at the bottom. And then we're gonna go to the next step where we're gonna take a small sample uh, using the Cytosoft data acquisition analysis software from Millipore and run it through the machine. This is a laser flow cytometer. It'll give us how many of those stem cells are alive and how many are dead. It's a whole new game-changing addition that can be included in the armamentarium as another tool to treat patients.